Hello and welcome to yet another episode of the Automation Lab. I'm Andy. So, for last week, we introduced building automation and lighting control. So for this week, we'll be introducing motion. Grace will go through review some of the unique aspects of back off motion, or I will have an interesting product showcase for you. Motion. What exactly is motion and how does back off position ourselves in this area? To make things a little easier, I'll split this into soft motion and hardware motion. For our software motion, we have various functionalities such as NCPTP, point-to-point -point for 10 axis, all the way to unlimited axis. We also have NC camming and interpolation. Not only that, we also have extreme fast control for motion. Kinematic transformations from level 1 to level 4. Robotics for MX automation as well as various CNC functions. Not only that, we also have libraries for pick and place, collision avoidance, hydraulic positioning, and our two biggest and newest products, XTS, the extended transport system, as well as the latest product, the X Planar. To show a better understanding of our two of our latest products, Please take a look at this video for XTS and XTERNAL. On hardware, Beckham's motion product lines range from our motors to our drives. But today, we'll be going through a special product. This is our compact motion, and this is our one cable technology. Straight off the bat, it's easy to see the main advantage of our compact drive technology. It's a servo drive in a 12mm bus terminal which enables seamless integration into a standard I.O. system. Here we have an EL7221-9014, which as you can see has the same form factor as two high-density I.O. terminals combined. This means you can slot the driver alongside your other I.O. for a cleaner setup. This is an earlier model of our motors. It required two cables for encoder feedback and motor connection. However, newer models only have a single cable for both these functions, which is where our OCT comes in. Connection to a motor is made easy with our OCT cables. Just connect the wires as you would for a normal IO terminal, and the motor can be controlled with the driver. As you can see, only one cable is used, which allows for lower cabling costs. There are accessories that complement the CDT drivers, such as the ZB8610 fan cartridge, which provides improved cooling and ventilation for I.O. terminals in general, but especially for power-intensive equipment such as the EL7221 as well.
In conclusion, compact drive terminals, small size, and system integrated form factor make them attractive to customers with benefits such as smaller space for drives and lower costs. Well, that's all the time we have for this week. If you've got any questions, you can comment down below. Or if you've got any inquiries, you can always email our sales at sales at backoff.com.sg. So until next time, wear a mask, stay safe, and see you next time. We hope you've enjoyed this week's session and stay tuned next week for Twin Cat Multi User. Till then, stay safe. Don't forget to like and share our Facebook page to your friends and colleagues.